and then um, the, it's still very good for Twitch because Twitch makes a lot of like Twitch makes their money from ads pretty much. So it's like for them, it's just win-win. The more they can make you play ads. Um, yeah. Well, it's still it's nice because if you reach, if you get your, if you get that offer and you can play the ads, it's probably more creators can make a more sustainable income, especially smaller streamers that are like. Um, are like just on the brink of being able to go full time or survive on streaming alone. So for them, it's definitely a very nice. Uh, I understand why people would go for the most ads possible then to make sure they can actually do that. But obviously, there's there should always be a limit. This is opponent. I have no idea. I don't think I ever played against him before. Woodland seems quite rough. It's good that they give the option, right? Yes. I mean, the option is there, right? All the creators can choose to then like, turn it down if they want to. But Twitch are forcing ads to be played, right? So there is still some of it there. But then again, every streaming platform will have to play ads. They need to make money as well. Oh, it's Vivi. Oh, okay, okay. How's YouTube streaming scene for creators nowadays? I think YouTube streaming has improved a lot. But like the fact that YouTube and Facebook are like starting to become real competitors for Twitch, or showing that like, hey, hey, we're here. You, you cannot have this free monopoly forever. I think that's just very good for the scene altogether because competition drives quality. And the better of a streaming platform Twitch is, the better of a streaming, plat streaming platform YouTube has to be, the better of a streaming platform Facebook has to be. So it's positive for everyone that uh, there are multiple streaming platforms that are becoming real competitors. And that might, in the long run, force... Like, Twitch obviously has a head start and an advantage. And long term, they start losing streamers to YouTube, Facebook, whatnot. There's a big chance they will have to really... Start making changes that are suddenly more positive for creators. Rather than only thinking about... Um, how to push Twitch as a platform for them to make revenue and whatnot. You have to think like a business, obviously, no matter what. Can't blame Twitch or Amazon in that case for doing that. But the fact that Facebook and YouTube are are there is, is good for everyone that wants to stream on Twitch as well. Oh shit. Okay. That was not good for me. What's it say, Burgundians? F indeed. You can resign again. Uh. 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 Be the most pretty lure, but it works. Competition is good for streamers and viewers. Exactly. They always want to push the limits, right? Uh, what am I playing here? I mean, I imagine he would be quite passive. Maybe I can just go fast castle. What was the 104? It uh, Don't resign. That's the taunt. There's a mem taunt pack. Dude, I hear enough of mems yelling. I don't need to hear more. Do we just YOLO this in Fast Castle? Based on the assumption that he will play passive because he's Burgundians? 
I cannot make camels. That's not so simple. I'm thinking just like fast casting this. And play plume dodgers. I love plume dodgers. They're always fun to play. Okay, actually, let's, uh, we'll do a nice trick over here. Yeah, we're going. We're fast castling. It's confirmed. Now I think he actually will play a few later, so he will open with scouts anyway. So it's not necessarily great for us to go fast castle. But we'll try. Exactly, Pantelis. Exactly. But turns out it's not so simple. Surprisingly. Naked fast castle. Somewhat naked, yes. <coughs> but, uh... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Can I debate him and actually wall in his scout? Instead? Oh, almost. Oh shit! Uh, oh, if, did I? How long has my T been idle? I wonder. Is that open? Wait, oh, this is still open. True. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna have an idle will forever, but still. It's worth it. Wait, what? He sniped the will through the corner. Cheater. Oh, shit. I don't like this. <laughs> I mean, I guess it would feed a scout, but at least those scouts are not going to harass me while they're doing that. But it's not all bad. I think he will just go Kustelir and be happy with that himself. What oh, is up here? Go oh, there. Go oh, there. Maybe that's too many. No, they're all work. They are all, are all working. This is fine. Are plumes even good against Burgundians? If you think about it, though. Because he will have Cavalier potentially. Not sure if he's even good. Don't think so, actually. Could try and trap him there. 
He really wants that one. Actually, let's go f forward, castle. Get that gold. Uh, stone, sorry. It is a greedy approach. But hey. Why not? Is there anything good at, that is good against Costelier? Well, Mangra. Usually a ranged mobile... Uh, mobile ranged unique units are usually quite good against Costelier. Need one TC here, then we're good. We'll go for a second castle as well. And it's all looking fairly promising. I would say. Would like to deny him relics. He's Burgundians after all. That also would mean that I need to know where the relics are. Not doing that part so great yet. There's one. There's one. Is Vivi streaming right now? Sounds like it. Yeah, I'm really basing my game on being able to snag the relics here. Well, that's an important part of this, at least. I assume he is going coastal here. I don't actually know. But the fact that I don't see any cavalier yet makes me think... Oh, shit. Ah! Couldn't trap them. Okay, he's going cooler. Just a few nights. First. I'm very happy with this. I'm getting the relics. No, oh, we got one, it's fine. I oh, know, I feel like I'm in a good spot, but we also, we know, it's Burgundian's eco. So what I feel might not be the truth. So we have four relics, pretty much guaranteed at this point. And let's drop another castle there. Ah, shit. Oh, 
Why did that monk stop? That is not very fun. Yeah, I could get all five relics here. What? They one-shot them? That's sad. Yeah, we might get all, all five relics here. At least four. We're looking very good for four. That is fine. I think. I need ballistics. That's what I need. What? He got the conversion. Wow. Just fighting under the castle. Stop looking because I assumed he would go away. How much of a fool was I? Not gonna lie, this unit does feel kind of dumb. That castle should have been up though. I mean, I'm still looking good to get all relics. It's kind of the aim. I would say. This is the issue. He doesn't care running under castles either, by the looks of it. We also need armor upgrade. We need thumb ring. We need a couple of things. We also need houses. We need farms. Macro is slipping a bit. We'll have three castles producing though. Oh. Maybe I should have made a castle there. I think he's gonna come forward to make a castle. We're on the hill anyway. Oh, I failed that one. Okay, I still think that's fine. But I cannot let those touch villagers, because they one-shot villagers. Oh, rip. I think I just need to get the imp right now. And then take it from there. Can't complain about five relics. Still don't like my position that much. I think he's gonna be up faster, and I think he will have a better eco. You think your time is a bit off after turn 32? There's multiple things that are a little bit off. Time 
timing is not necessarily one of them. It's just all the small micro things. Yeah, the longer it takes for him to hit imp, the better though. Obviously. It feels so tanky as well. Turbo medicine worth in this situation. I'm not sure if it's worth it for mines because I already have uh, like the units I have aren't. Oh, he's just a very aggressive. The units I have aren't don't have that much HP. I'm not sure if it makes much sense. Mm, okay, let's hope I get in fast first. Starting to look uh, realistic at this point. He does have fletching. He might be going for skirms then. I think he's doing another castle here. I don't want him to do that castle. Well, moment of truth. Man, those Corsairs are sick. I know they're mostly good when they have the charge. If I can't, if once the charge is gone, they're not necessarily as good anymore. But still, that feels so good. I should have probably not commit there. Uh. I can maybe fight now after taking out his... Issue is that he's gonna think the same. Serious just feels so dumb, honestly. How many villagers to tank one trebuchet? I don't know. Like, I feel like it doesn't matter that I have counter units because the charge attack just melts uh, them anyway because they're such low HP units. I don't have all upgrades, obviously, so that's a contributor. Now, I took a bad fight early in. I will admit that. I still feel like this this is this this unit just feels it feels wrong. Let me see a timeline here. Oh, we actually take a really good lead. I think we are in a very good position, but I, I misplayed the mid-game when I let this Custodiers get into my eco, for example. I could I should have made a pikeman switch earlier. Um my eco management in general was was poor. So it's not only the unit, it's also that I just played worse here.